Hi, pizza lovers. Today I want to show you a homemade pizza, Her Majesty, Pizza Margherita. I know, I know what you're thinking. It's super easy making pizzas by using your professional or semi-professional ovens. And you know what? You are right. Whoever loves Neapolitan pizzas should be able to make pizzas at home easily and without spending a fortune. Otherwise, it would be better ordering your pizza from the nearest pizza restaurant. In my channel, you learn how to make a super easy dough, but also how to make a fantastic Neapolitan pizza at home by using a frying pan or a carbon steel with tremendous results if you consider the non-professional tools we have been using so far. But the main issue for having a proper Neapolitan pizza at home is mainly about the oven temperature. How can we reach 480 degrees Celsius or 900 degrees Fahrenheit in a regular domestic oven? And here is where we go back to the initial statement. Do we need to have expensive professional or semi-professional ovens to reach that temperature? And these ovens are not particularly cheap. The cheapest they're all is 160 euro. But in order to have a better pizza, you have to spend way more, 500, 1000 euro or more. But today I have just one goal. And the goal is to build a pizza oven by spending less than I would have spent to buy two pizzas. <laughs> two pizzas in Ireland are about 20 euro. Uh, it's a few money, but it doesn't matter. I promise to build a pizza oven for less than 20 euro. From a logistics, uh, cost and uh, a practicality point of view, a gas oven could be too much for now. So let's focus on an electric oven. Electric ovens generally comprise a chamber, a heater element above in the so-called sky and one at the bottom, also known as stalls, which can be made of cauterized or baked clay, the so-called biscuit. Since cooking takes place by radiation and convention, a lower chamber would allow more heat to be concentrated without any dispersion. The heat source would be generated by the combustion of methane gas. To recreate the conditions of stalls, I will use a stone capable of reaching high temperatures in a short time. As a starting point, I will be using a frying pan and a pizza stone like this one. But now before starting, there's something you should read. And now it's time to think of the heat source of the top of the oven. And honestly, I don't think there's other solution than taking a heater from a real oven. Exposing the pizza to the heat of a heating element mounted on the top and that of the flame at the bottom of the pan and the stone will simulate a pizza oven. We will need something resistant enough not to get damaged by the heat, something like steel as instance, and big enough to contain the heater and cover the whole surface of the frying pan. Hmm, I could try with another frying pan on top, but I don't think it's a good idea as it would be too hot for the aluminium. Better trying with something else. Maybe a bow? Hmm. Resistant, thick enough, this is what I need. But there are two issues. I don't think this bowl is good for the purpose, as it's too deep and the heat can disperse even in areas where we don't need it. And the second issue is about my wife. I don't think she's happy me to make holes on this bowl. I need to find a bowl big but not deep. Hold on! It seems mad, but Amazon is suggesting this, a huge dog bowl. This would allow pizza to stay closer to the heater. This is what I need. The heater element. Mm. Pizza ovens generally have two heater elements, one on top and one at the bottom, and they are about uh, 1200 watts. People who hack these ovens usually move the bottom um, heater element on the top to have a total uh, amount of 2400 watts. What if I look for a 2500 watts heater element? And now a power cable able to manage 2500 watts. I think this one is the best and it's the cheapest, 10 amperes. Subtotal, less than 20 euro. Let's order it. And now, let's build the oven!
Sí. It works, but before cooking a pizza, thumbs up if you liked the video and subscribe to my channel. Hi pizza lovers, today I want to show you a homemade pizza which got cooked in a 20 euro pizza oven. Now I need your help to improve the oven. Electricians, engineers or experts, please follow me on Instagram. You can find me as Gigio Pizza. Send a video with your ideas and I will share your ideas in one of the next episodes of this series. And I will choose one or two ideas to make the next iteration of the oven. Thumbs up if you liked the video and subscribe to my channel and tap the bell. See you next time, bye.